Hello guys, this is Ayuklevi. I'm so sorry it's been a while I've done to two years. Um, it's actually not my fault. It's my fault. I wouldn't blame it on anybody. I'll take responsibility. Yes, I've taken responsibility. I'm so sorry about that. So I'm back again and today um, I'm promising you today that I'm not going to be gone for a very long time again unless, you know, I don't know. Let's start. So um, what I'm, I'm going to be talking about today is very, very simple and it's going to be fast. So it's um, it's called um, extrude along curve and this can be used for many different things. Um, one of the things I'm using it for is, uh, you know, all the stands that they use in bank, um, in a bank place or um, let's say all these um, police um, do not enter a, a victim scene or something like that. They use it dead so that is exactly what i'm gonna be making today so the first thing i'm gonna do is i'll go to um polygons and i'm just gonna create so uh, let me use uh this so another thing you can use it for is a snake instead of you um extruding extruding um you just go on and like this you, uh, you'll have model the um, head the snake head and then you can go on and do um the extrude along curve and it's gonna generate your snake straightforward. So I would go to rate it and change it to 90. And that is all I need to um to for now. So uh I'm just gonna go to the side um front view and I will create my curve. Go to create and you would see curve. I, I will just select EP curve. I think that one is cool. Then select pretty much anything. So uh I would press shift shift select those so that is all i have now it's a straight line so i'll go to the top view right click and go to control vertex so um i can now select the ones i want and the ones i don't want so you can just see this uh, let me hold on can go to yes i think that is what is happening so now i'm going to select the whole thing here shift on select and shift select this and then voila that is it that is exactly what i want to achieve so um the thickness um i can just stretch it out that will be off um the guy there so just stretch it out um then offset so this is what i'm really what i'm talking about now you know usually snakes will always have a timing um tail that is exactly what we can do to achieve that 0.5 i don't even understand this thing again yeah when serving school so that is exactly what i'm saying now watch this if i select this guy now um this guy and press delete it's gonna delete the whole thing so i don't want that i'm just gonna select this one or the two together and i would go to edit um delete by type history and then i can delete this guy now so i'm left with this my guy and that is how to do it is you can see this looks exactly like a snake and that is what we are really looking for so um maybe in the future i'm just uh, i would model um the snake head and we can combine this guy to hit later on so thank you so much guys for watching this tutorial i'm so sorry that this is um, extremely basic so i just want to make a welcome um tutorial so that next time you can make something um solid Thank you so much guys for watching. I really appreciate you for being with me always. Seriously, you guys have tried. Seriously. Thank you so much. So, I'm saying we shall be meeting again in peace and not in pieces. So, peace out guys.